How's it going, everybody? We're heading into the weekend. It's Friday, and this is your used gear highlight of the day. So today, I want to talk to you a little about some of the used boots that we have. Uh, these ones specifically kind of have two applications, and it's good for those uh, that are looking either for a women's specific boot or some of these boots are really good for kids. And the reason being is uh, the plastic's a little bit softer, they're easier to flex, and the sizing generally goes pretty small. So I'm gonna show you uh, three versions of the Scarpa T2 uh, in our used boot section and kind of walk you through the differences as you're kind of looking through stuff. So the first one, we actually see a lot of these. This, this particular version of the T2 has not been made for a really long time, but there's a lot of them out there. Uh, kind of early, mid 2000s, you would see a lot of these paired with the G3 Targa binding. So between those two products, you're, you've got a lot of them out there. Um, it's a really good boot though, if someone's looking for a real basic two buckle boot that isn't too high. And uh, you know, for people these days that are either looking to get into telly, or you might even wanna make just like a little cruiser setup for kind of your rolling hills, uh, backcountry behind the house, golf course, that kind of thing. This works really well. Also great for kids. So this is a basic T2. This particular one's in a 25.0 Mondo. Two buckle construction, non-moldable liner. So that's, that's something important to notice. Uh, still a good liner, not something that's gonna mold to your foot specifically. Three pin compatible and just really basic design. Even the ski walk on this is very basic. All it is is just kind of this little plastic and it just kind of latches into here. So nothing too fancy. So this is actually a specific women's T2, kind of from the same era. This one's in a size 23.0. Very, very similar construction, but uh, they started going to this power beam deal on the side. And it's kind of at this point that Scarpa starts to become a little bit wider boot. If you're an old telly person, way back in the day when there was Garmont and Scarpa and they were the predominant boots in the market, everyone thought Garmont's wide, Scarpa's narrow. Well, over time it kind of flip-flopped, Garmont went away and Scott purchased them. And those boots, generally speaking, became more narrow and the Scarpa boots became a little bit wider. You're only talking a couple millimeters, but that's something to keep in mind. So this is a three buckle women's boot, still pretty soft plastic. This does have a wrap intuition heat moldable liner, but you'll notice it's kind of a, a riff of that last ski walk. It's got a, actually a little metal bar here that comes undone if I can actually get it out. And then it unlatches like that. So kind of nothing too tricked out on the back. And you can see it's kind of an evolution of the, the other boot I was just showing you. Uh, also great for kids. These boots rock and the sizing. And also because uh, as kids are growing, sometimes their feet are growing, but maybe their legs aren't growing. And so you need like a shorter cuff for that to work well. Kind of an evolution of that was the T2X which is pretty closely related to the, the women's uh, T2 Eco that we currently have. It's a three buckle boot with a power strap, uh, moldable intuition liner. You can see the ski walk mode's a little bit different on this one. Uh, it's got more of this bar system that you'd see on most of the other boots. And uh, just all around great boot. Not super stiff, still really good for kids as well, if you can find the right size, and not super stiff uh, in the bellow or the, the overall boot. So three really good options if you're looking for a women's specific used boot or a boot that might work for, for young kids or young adults that maybe don't have uh, a ton of weight behind them to flex the boot. So that's your used gear highlight for the day, you guys. Thanks for checking it out. Hope you're having a great week and hope you have a, even a better weekend. If you have any questions about this stuff, you can email, e you can email us at customerservice at freeheallife.com and we'll see you next week.